Alright, okay, so Diddy already uh, reached a resolution for the case of Cassie. I think a lot of people are under the impression that it just it was just filed. I'm pretty sure it was already filed. He already knew about it. Um, and it just basically ended up in the public's eye. Similar to this new case that um, was filed against him. So, I really feel like he's going to have quite a few. This is really, really crazy. So, this is according to a CNN article. And you can go um, check it out. I'm not able to link it for some reason. You know, we can't really do a lot of linking up here. Um, basically, the heading says his name and talk about how he faces another lawsuit accused of essay and revenge corn corn on the cob reading between the lines so again there's another um person that filed a civil suit that was filed under the new york adult survivors act and they named him and his companies including bad boy entertainment and um not looking good so basically there was a suit filed in the new york supreme court um oh <laughs> it demands a trial by jury and seeks damages so the plaintiff brings suit against the defendants um to redress the substantial and lifetime image um injuries that she suffered as a result of being Bill Cosby essayed and the A word. Um, and being the victim of uh, revenge corn on the cob, allegedly, that um, he created and distributed. Oh my gosh. So, according to them uh, a cone says that these um, are made up and are not uh, credible allegations and is purely a money grab Whew. so <laughs> I'm just sitting here tripping I'm gonna read the article so basically the victim and her name is in the article I'm not going to say it. I'm going to say Miss Neal. And at the time, she was a Syracuse University student back in 1991 when the incident occurred. And um, she actually appeared with him in a few video clips of a music video. And that's in the article as well. Um, and the suit alleged she agreed to have dinner at the Harlem restaurant reluctantly with him and... Um, on a school break for a holiday in January when he pushed her to um, keep him company while he attended a few things in the city and during this time he, he um, Bill Cosby her allegedly and um, it, it basically res in the accusations it resulted in her being in a physical state where she could not independently stand or walk okay these were serious accusations and um while at dinner she left to use the restroom and left her drink unattended this is in the article and um this is part a part of the allegations in the suit and then it says in the car the suit alleges that he took, um, she took a puff, um, under duress, according to her, in the car. And from that point on, she did not remember everything because her memories was, um, incomplete at that time. Like, basically, okay. And then, um driving first to the music studio where she could not get out of the car and and the allegations
positions she was as a um and because she was cosbied the plaintiff lacked the physical ability or mental capacity to fend him off this is a part of the suit allegations and as you can see I'm reading here um the crazy thing is um who the accusations um sound similar to some of the other women that went through a lot of things dealing with him and uh, I'm not saying you know I, I don't know I don't know the man all I know is this is yet another lawsuit um oh it also says there was a recording and days later a male friend to her had viewed it and um this is crazy wait a minute yeah a friend of hers has seen it and viewed it um others had said that they seen it and basically a lot of responses were saying everybody has seen it um uh thereafter there were allegations of um her life being uh basically in the tales being after everything happened um she was admitted to a hospital for severe depression um suited eyed reading between the lines um this is a part of the accusations so these are very detailed accusations um and whew. now this is what i would say and i'm not saying um that they can't be proven what i can say is with miss ventura's case she had so many receipts so many details and she was a part of this man's life for a very long time now with this one um i don't know because she would have to have major receipts she would be able, have to be able to you know this was before we were able to track being in locations and um i'm thinking maybe she got some of these people from the past to come in and attest to what they've seen or you know these videos or whatever that happened um i don't know because i i continue to look at it like um who's next that's what i'm gonna say i'm just gonna say who's next because i'm pretty sure they're the suits are already in because like i said previously the new york adult Sur survivors act um is due to expire so i'm pretty sure a lot of people have chimed in and went ahead and put their lawsuits in and y'all let me know what y'all think because this thing is getting thick for him and this is something that generally a lot of people are able to get away with in a sense because you know when you high powered you can't get served um it's, it's just a lot of layers to being able to hold people accountable so um yeah diddy